century. Good evening and good morning, ladies and gentlemen. It's 8 p.m. here and time for something special. Time for the most impactful and craziest pop news show on planet Instagram, featuring crazy collectors, awesome customizers, and uncommon cars. And here he is, your host, the Kim of Collectors. Let's start the Hot Wheels Travel Journey Show. So, <laughs> so hello hey guys. guys. Hey guys, welcome to the Hot Wheels Travel Jimmy Show, session nine. So um, today um, uh, we have our big unboxing party. So um, we grabbed some of these uh, really cool masks from Laura, one of our um, um, sweet girls here in the agency. Uh, she was building up these really cool masks because yeah, unboxing party needs also unboxing us our faces and so on and we are really happy that you are here and uh, let's grab some caps so as you know me the man with the cap so nice that you're here so uh, today uh, we have no agenda as you know because uh, we only want to unboxing these 100 uh, car package we got and we also got a little package I think perhaps two to three cars are in and uh, yeah we want to start with you to to um, unboxing all this stuff and it's really I grab this stuff here and it's really it's really heavy so and it's really heavy and we are exciting it as I posted uh, uh, today um, we're waiting now Stefan uh, three days four days yeah to unboxing this stuff we don't know what's inside as you know one of our posts um, we uh, we um, had was um, these yellow boxes with the cars you saw and there were a, a lot of or a big bunch of cars in the uh, in the package and today we hope we find some really nice stuff because um, we are thinking about if we find some loose nice loose cars and double cars and so on we will um, also can use the cars for the next giveaway session or as we ask you today uh, about our um, uh, story um, if we should do some uh, some ruffles because we are thinking um, um, to sell some of our really um, old and rare cars uh, at the moment and uh, because we have so much double cars uh, um, um, collecting the last years and um, yeah and this is why we on, on one side did all these uh, giveaways and uh, but on the other side is you know it we also need some money, Stefan, because we have to set up every week uh, two shows or, uh, well, minimum one show and uh, to prepare all the stuff. So we want 
to have some uh, only to have some 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 money for some food. This is Stefan's uh, chips he is eating today, and uh, that's it. Yeah, that's it. <laughs> only, only that's it. So so no no meat, no no pommes, no burgers, what else? <laughs> so yeah. And uh, this is why we are asking to doing some 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 raffles. No, uh, this was a joke. Um, only to say we have uh, collecting the last 10 years so much cars um, 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 on the different uh, uh, markets. Um, there are a lot of cars we want uh, to sell and and show you also. And uh, let's do on Monday, yeah, because um, um, as you know, our 14 cars seven days. This is not on Monday because it's a week later. We were drawn the winner for the 14 days. 40 um, uh, uh, car session and on Monday we will set up some yeah the first raffle to see um, um, how we can engage you if you like the cars you can go into the raffle if and I think you you as guys you also know these uh, 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 these raffles uh, there's a lot of raffles at the moment uh, on Instagram mm. but we will see this is the stuff on Monday so let's open the box uh, we are waiting as you know um, uh, four to uh, three to four days and uh, we will see what's inside and we are really exciting or Stefan indeed indeed yeah come on here for the first time and we will open together um, our big uh, big box with the loose cars and then let's see what's inside and uh, yeah so and as you know our shows Stefan uh, sometimes will will watch you for all the comments and if I didn't answer, answer some comment uh, Stefan will will help me in into the chat and so it's really it's really heavy and difficult to open this stuff how heavy so, is it? I think it's nearly six to seven kilos wow yeah six to seven kilos so let's see there's a lot of uh, pa styropor packing material and ah and we see the first cars inside so so guys, so let's let's start. There's a lot of uh, there's a lot um, of cars. Maybe yeah. we can show we can show it from yeah, there. Yeah, I think we can we can show the first. Um, the you first, see that? Yeah, the first range of cars here and under this also. A, oh, it smells, uh, it's, smells it, it's smelling like old cars. <laughs> it's smelling it's smelling a little bit as Stefan said, like old cars and uh, used cars. But um, as you know, this was was a lucky moment uh, for us to to grab really really 100 cars here inside uh, the box and uh, we will see i saw a lot of really nice cars here inside but also some grab cars as you as you know and some really used cars so let's start with uh with a really nice found this is uh yeah this is the jeep it's a military you know this yeah it's a black wall this is really cool it's a color shifter oh right? i'm so sorry to disturb you it's H.S. birthday today! Oh, happy H. birthday! birthday! Happy birthday, AJ! Happy, happy birthday to you! Happy birthday to you! Happy birthday, dear AJ! Happy birthday to you! Woo! So, congratulations, man! Happy birthday! And uh, we know you are 20 years old. <laughs> we don't know, but happy birthday from our side and uh, so this is Jeff, uh, Stefan's job, as you as you as you know. He is he is a big reminder of uh, of me and the shows to yeah. get all informations. Yeah. Yeah. So let's start again with the with the car, the color shift to Jeep. It's really it's a nice found. It's a military version, and uh, it's a black wall, as you know, and uh, it's from yeah eighty one. This is a really nice car we put together because we have to go a little bit more faster. Then we yeah. have here. Um, we have here. It's a newer car. I think 2010. It's a it's a Dodge Charger. So it's not so really interesting for us. And then we have here. Um, what is this? The Roadrunner. It's also a nice muscle car, but it's yeah, it's too young for us. So we want to see some yeah. some more black walls, ultra huts, and so on. And uh, Stefan is taking here some space so that we can. Uh, that we have the space for all the cars. This is a really nice phone. This is uh, from 79, the Dodge, you know the car? Yeah, it's from the, I think the crash cars, right? I didn't know, yeah. So this is a really nice phone and it's in a really perfect condition. This is absolutely nice. And such cars we are looking for in this box, yeah? 
and also in this good condition. Absolutely perfect. So this is a nice found. Then we have another, ah, and this is a good example for a really grab car. It's also a black wall, it's a, it's a Porsche, and all, but <laughs> there is no color on the car. Yeah, it's a blank metal. Uh, it, it, it was red. It's from 82, the, um, what's the 928. It's built in Hong Kong. It's really nice. It's built in Hong Kong. Yes, it's an old car. We love the old cars, but yeah, as you, there is no color on it. So we will see. Then we have a car we shown you. We have um, um, here the Thunder Roller. Yeah, this is also really nice. So we have two, but uh, he is damaged. Oh. You see this guys, he is damaged. So this is, this is not good. Mm -hmm. So this is a car uh, we didn't know if sometimes you can repair the car, but um, yeah, this is, this is shit on our side. So, and um, let's see, uh, this is a nice one. This is a Ford Escort, uh, the black one, you know, the XR3 from Made in France. We have three or four of uh, these old Escorts, but the condition is really nice. Also, the wheels is a black wall, 82, made in France. It's a really valuable car, also as a loose car. So, really nice, really nice found. Then we have, uh, this is also, this is more for, for, for my son. This is a construction crane. You know it, it's also a black wall from, from the, I think, Workhorses series. Oh, a bit, no, not Workhorses, a, bit, a little bit later. It's from 89. So the crane is also nice, but also there is a piece missing in the front of the crane here. So it's, yeah, not the best, but it's a nice car, absolutely. So then we have here, yeah, this is a nice piece. This condition is really nice. This is a, I think this is a fire eater. Uh, uh, um, yeah, the fire eater, I think. This is uh, also the black wall, um, the fire truck, you know the car. It's um, it's written on the, on the body, Played it's uh, 76, but uh, coming out a little bit later was early of um, uh, was early of the 80s. But the condition is really nice. Yeah, okay. Here's some wheel, but it's not not damaged. All the parts are on, and also the the stems and the painting is is really nice. So, so Dicas collector, you are asking what is black wall? So I can tell you, because we are specialized on on these black walls. Um, you know, in, in, and I repeat a little bit the history of the cars because, as you know, the first cars are uh, coming out was a red liner, yeah, and uh, the red liner ended in uh, 74 to 76, and the black walls, yeah, and I can show you again the black walls. This is also mean the, the, the wheels, yeah, this is we the wheels are black wheels with the chrome standard uh, basic wheel here, and this was born of the name black wall. Yeah, and these are all um, 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 the description of uh, uh, of the wheels. Yeah, and uh, the base. This is the basic, and as I said in the last show, there were different colors of black wall uh, tires. Yeah, and wheels. And, uh, as I said, and the area of uh, uh, um, the era of the black walls begin on 74, 76. Really, they are beginning and. Um, yeah, air cool seven. It's a fire eater. Yes. <laughs> yeah. And so I hope uh, Decars collector, I um, uh, you understand uh, the back wall. It's coming. Was the main line and the um, the cars coming after the red lines, and it's all based from the name on on the black wheels. So then we have our nice thing. It's not the best condition. Um, it's uh, I forgot the name. I showed it last week. It's the ultra hot. You know. You know the car. Yeah. It's also in a. In, uh, it's a good condition. It's not perfect because of the wheels and uh, yeah, this is also really nice. So then we have, I will show you all the three pieces because then I didn't repeat me. This is our, um, what's the name? What's the name of it? Uh, the wheel loader, the three wheel loader. It's from 79. Yeah, it's from, from I think this is from the workhorses, right? So we have three examples in the box. One is uh, missing the front. Uh, one uh, has bad con condition wheels. Stefan is destroying all the good cars in the background, and uh, this. <laughs> but this condition is uh, is uh, is really good. So, Dikas Collector X, you have a question on Stefan and Jimmy. You have to watch on the phone. Yes, yes. Yeah, yeah. So, what's your question? We are hearing, we are listening to because you. Because even they have black wheels. Can you call the modern ones? Black wheels, because they have black wheels. No. 
No, I don't know um, uh, the names. The names of uh, the wheel names, they lost a little bit this history stuff because, as you know, first they're coming the wheel rider, yeah, uh, the, the, the red liner. So then you have the black walls with the basic wheels, then there are coming the, the um, 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 uh, hot ones. Yeah, with another wheel uh, wheels, I will see if we find some 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 hot ones here in the box. And then they are coming the golden uh, hot ones. Then there was the ultra huts. Yeah, the ultra huts more on the description of the cars, not on directly on on the wheels. And then Mattel or Hot Wheels loses a little bit the name of the wheels because then we have also um, set up in '83 the real riders, as you know, the real riders. Now we have real riders because this, but. Um, Today I don't know the name of uh, um, uh, of the newer uh, um, of the newer um, Hot Wheels wheels. I don't know. There are five spokes and so on, or or some other wheels. But I don't know uh, what's the description at the moment of the wheels because there's more on collections at the moment. The real riders stay as the real riders, yes. And uh, but um, yeah, super treasure hunts and treasure hunts. You know because all on the symbols uh, we have on the blister and on the car. But um, there is no description at the moment, I think, on, on, uh, on the wheels at the moment. So I hope to answer your question. Then we have three of this. You know the cars, yeah? You know the cars. This is one in a, in a really good condition. So also the bikes are uh, in, a, in a fantastic condition. And we have two cars. Uh, there's broken some stuff. And we have two uh, in a really bad condition. So we have to think about what we, what we can do for, for this uh, damaged car. But one uh, is in a really good condition. So this is a uh, lack on our side that we have one. Then there is another fire eater. Yeah, I go a little bit faster to uh, all the packages. Otherwise, we don't. Um, bring uh, all the stuff together then we have the long uh, the long shot uh, also these uh, trucks there's one uh, uh, this is in a better condition of the chrome parts this is in a better condition because of the painting so uh, yeah we can decide what we will do with the cars but it's really cool it's from 82 it's also built in hong kong uh, i love the trucks this is a nice found because two two pieces so and we can see if we can sell the cars for two to three euros for example yeah, then we have the uh, the tail rider, you know the car from 80, 80, uh, 84. It's also a nice found. We have the car five, six, seven, eight times, I think so. But it's good to have the car. It's uh, it's not the most valuable, but it's really nice. So guys, and this is a nice found because again, here as I showed and bought a, 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 a Volkswagen Golf 1, this is another Monte Carlo. There is no, uh, there is uh, um, um, not so much painting on it, but um, it's the hair splitter, you know it, it's from 78 and uh, the original parts are on the roof and this is this is nice. So no matter, it's it's a good car and uh, I think this is a nice phone. So then we have, then we have, um, what's this? Um, I don't know the name. No, this is uninteresting. Oh, we have another Mercedes 380. Um, it's, a, it's a golden ultra hot. And um, uh, it's a golden hot one, sorry. It's from 81 uh, and also building in, uh, in Hong Kong. And this is also in a really nice condition. So nice found, I love the car. Um, we have some in old cards, you know it. Then we have, ah, it's a nice crash car. So it's a crack up, yeah? We have a nice crash car here. And I'm losing some of the cards. So the wheels are function in function because the cars rolling up. So this is really nice. It's a it's a crash car. So I didn't have the 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 red one. I have a lot of other uh, variations, but it's in it's a nice found. It's in a really good condition. So also nice found. Then, oh, we have a red race bait three zero eight from seventy seven. The Ferrari, you know it. I show you some of these silver cars and we give some of these silver Ferraris as a giveaway. So, and here we have the red one. Yeah, it's also really nice. So I have some painting on, on, on the wheel, but I think we can clean this stuff. And uh, this is a nice fun. And then we have another Ferrari, also from 77. It's not called a race bike. And I don't know what the guys are doing with this car. I think this was a color shifter. Yeah, and they're painting the car in, uh, I think, with an adding with a pencil in, in black. 
So I think we can clean this stuff, uh, bring it back to a color shifter, yeah, and then we have a nice, uh, uh, also a nice phone. I've so, got a question. Yes. If the red one has to look so destroyed, but I think, yes, I remember when I was small, I had one of this. Then you have it, have the car here, yeah, like and looking, crash it, crash looking it, great, and, and then you crash, crash it. Car. Yeah. Yeah. Then the hood goes up, and you see this, uh, uh, this crash. These are the crash cars. And they are really cool. I, uh, we will have some some of the um, uh, in the next weeks some uh, uh, standalone session for only the crash cars, the flip outs, and so on. And here's a good example for an, for a flip out. Only uh, uh, also on the series of the um, of the crash cars because here you can uh, change. You have here your cockpit, as you know, and if you are crashing the car, then yeah. It rolls and opened a uh, uh, simulate a crash on the car. Yeah, and this is also uh, this is uh, uh, the flip out, and um, yeah, it's also a nice car, not the best condition, but oh, this is really nice. We have a lot of other crash cars here, and this is also really nice. 83, really perfect condition. Uh, crash car, you see here, and uh, it's also the crash area. And often at the crash cars, these plastic parts are missing. So you can buy a lot of these crash cars without plastic in the back because it flipped out the plastic and, uh, and the kids never found the plastic again or throw it away or, or what else. Yeah, as AJ said, lost it. Yeah, and um, yeah, this is, but it's a fantastic condition. This is a really nice found in the 100 car package. Then also really nice another crash car. It's a it's a red truck here, and uh, this is also built in Hong Kong in 48. And here he has his crash uh, area in the back. Yeah. So. 48. Uh, 84. I said 48. 84. Sorry. Yeah. So, but what's missing? Here's missing the plastic cabin. Yeah. And this is. In, in, in 80 or 90 percent of the cars you can buy from the crash cars from these trucks, the plastic cabin is missing. And this is a part, yeah, it's really important to have the value on, on, on this car if you have um, the plastic cabin, right? So, um, another crash car, because it's a side crash car, it's also, um, um, in, yeah, as you know, and this is a side door. This is a side door is crashing, so this is an original. Then you crash the car on the side, and yeah, it's yeah, and then the crash, the door rolls, and then you have the crash side. Yeah. So what we have now, a lot of ah, uh, and this is, I never saw this car before. This is a this is a Jet Sweep X5 from '84. This is an ultra hot, but it's an yeah, it's an really turbine dragster and this is i don't have this car in my collection i collect it a lot but um this is really cool it's like um it's like a metallic leg, uh, like on on the old red liners it looks like yeah but it's an ultra ultra hot from 84 and it's uh, with a nice big metal turbine in it and uh, really cool really cool this is a nice phone yeah so and uh <clears throat> so let's open the window because again about all our, our spots it's really hot inside oh this is also ultra hot you know the the ferrari yeah and um what was the age uh the building in 80 85 yeah the ultra hot ferrari this is perfect condition this is really it's also a nice one but we have stefan i think 15 to 20 50 to 20 of this as a loose car yeah, it's, it's really often you find this car on the market. Then we have again two, two old, uh, the old number five uh, fire truck. And uh, it's really cool because the plastic is intact here and not missing. On this car also the most uh, plastic parts are missing on the side or the kids destroy the plastic parts and, and what else. And it's from 80, 80, uh, from 80, yeah, 1980. Also nice found the cars. Stefan. Uh, Diecast Collector X is yeah. asking, do you guys have the stock Mustang, the one with the flip open body? With the flip open body. So from which from which year it's a car? From we have to know from which year the car is, then you can I can answer your question then. 
because um, it's a lot of Mustangs. I don't know all the cars in the collections exactly, but if you have the age for us, then we can, um, I can think about if you have the car. I don't know at the moment. Yeah. yeah? I was in a PM with a picture and then... Yeah, yeah. This is really cool. So then we have a T-Bird. Yeah, we have a 77 uh, a keyboard. Uh, T-Bird, this is also in a nice condition. We have the car, but the condition is really nice. Also on the windows, there are blue windows and uh, perfect car, super nice. Then we have a 55 Chevy here. And also, this is a color shifter. Yeah, this is also a color shifter. We know the Chevy, it's going from red into yellow and uh, it's not the best painting on this side. But it's intact and uh, as a color shifter, it's really nice. Most things, uh, there's some breaking up some of these color shifting color from, from the roof or from the sides. And also a nice car. Ah, and then we have, um, this is also really nice. It's from, yeah, this is the Sheriff, the Sheriff Patrol. This is also a really nice car. It's also in the era, era of the black walls. So and then oh this is this is this is a nice font. This is uh the um the neat streeter. It's from 75 from Hong Kong. This is a nice font. Yeah, this is a valuable car because of um, um the painting in the back with the Ford logo. Yeah, and the condition is it's good, it's not perfect, but it's really good, and this is a valuable car, and uh we have here um Another one, another hot rod, yeah. It's also good condition with some flames on it and it's from 79, also built in Hong Kong. This is great, yeah. And also the lamps are here because this is sometimes the problem. The lamps are broken or the grill in the front is broken, but on the, it's really nice. So, good. Hmm. Ah, and this is an example what I mean, guys. This is another hot rod and here you see broken lamp. So this is, and this is also a color shifter, I think. No, it's no color shifter. It's only, um, it looks like a color shifter, but yeah, this is broken. So if we don't find some, some second parts, this, I don't know. We have to collect it, but it's going into a box, not to do it in, in some displays. Ah, guys, and this is really cool. As you know, I'm, um, uh, I'm a, a, a Camaro collector. And this is a, a red um, a metallic Z28 Camaro. It's a golden hot ones. This is really cool. This is a nice font, absolutely. And it's from 82 um, with a big Camaro stamp. I don't know it, you, you, you don't see it, I, I know it, but uh, this car is it's good. Some, some, some things on, on uh, here over the wheel, but in fact, it's, it's, uh, it's a perfect car. Ah, and then, the luck is on our side, yeah? Lucky moments, lucky moments. Here in the box are some of the real riders, and this is really cool. This is really cool. So guys, the first real rider in our package. As you know, last show, I'm showing you um, 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 uh, the show before, some of the real riders, and the condition is it's really good. But as you know, in front, there is a part that is missing, but yeah, the byway man is uh, it's absolutely fantastic. We love the real riders, you know, and the wheels are uh, in a perfect condition because they are white and uh, there's no nothing on it. And we have a Chevy C10. Uh, it's from '82. It's also a real rider. It's a loose car, but it's a real rider. Also really nice found. It's also not in the best condition, as you know. It's a it's a used car, but it's a real rider. So the next car, oh, we have another real rider. Uh, there's some missing parts, but uh, it's it's the Jeep from 90, from the 80s. Yeah, it's also a real rider, but we are missing um, the window before, yeah, in front. We are missing the window, but it's okay. It's it's a real rider, so. Oh, guys, and there are a lot of other real riders in our box. So we have another by women from 82. I show you the car, but it's also in the box. And this is, yeah, so our value of uh, paying with the box, uh, uh, or what we have paid for the box, uh, it's absolutely in, yeah, at the cars we are founding at the moment, it's absolutely in. And then, uh, the 44, this is nice. Absolutely nice. So, another real rider, and it's 
really in a perfect condition. This is really in a perfect condition. Yeah, this is really nice. So this is a real wider end. Uh, the best things coming uh, in in a, in a couple. There's another. So we have two of the cars, two rear riders. Yeah, this is uh, absolutely cool. It's a four. Uh, it's a four two door. You know this. Uh, it's from eighty two. Two rear riders. Perfect condition. So then we have here. Oh, it's also um, um, a Ford uh, a two door, but this is a black wall version. Yeah. So we have here the back wall version and then we have here the real rider version. So and this is nice. We have this two and yeah, we have a triple of these cars, two real riders and one um one black wall and all the same condition. Really nice. Yeah, looks like really fantastic. The cars are absolutely cool. So Stefan is missing the, the best part. Yeah, and uh, ah guys, there's another. So it's a red version also in it. And look at this color. This is the red metallic. This is really cool. Really cool. And we double this. So there are a lot of these 40 uh, Fords in it. And uh, really nice cars. Um, um, 82, as I said. Uh, so we have uh, three black, black versions, two red versions in our package. And uh, so let's have a look. We have a lot of... I don't want to talk too long. Um, I don't know if you are interesting in um, the old timer cars, but uh, there are three of the old timers: a, a, a white liner, yeah, and a, a doozy. No, the doozy is here, I think. Yeah. So four of these are old timers. Yeah, from. 76 from 81 from uh, in this is a Bugatti yeah and what's really interesting is uh, the uh, wheel in the back the double wheel in the back yeah the reserve uh, things it's it's also built in Hong Kong it's from 1980 and uh, the classic Packard also built in Hong Kong 82 yeah so nice founds so we are tired Today, I, we, are I, we are tired today. I don't know. Yeah. We need to drink. Cheers. Yeah, we need to drink. Cheers, guys. Cheers. We have, we have um, was a really hard day for us today in the agency. We we're working a lot, have a lot of meetings today. Mm. And uh, yeah, so um, then we have here. One, two, three. One to three um, of these white liners. Yeah, it's built in Malaysia, 8087. I forget the name because I'm not so good in these old timer cars. Yeah, I have a lot of these, but I'm not good in these uh, in the name. So, but the condition is really cool. Yeah, it's uh, nothing broken, and uh, the wheels are in a good condition. So, also nice found. Yeah. Okay, then uh, I will have a second break, guys. Stefan will come here. I have a second break. And then uh, then we pick uh, all the cars again. So. so I clean my my desk. Clean my desk a little bit. Putting the mask here. Yeah. So. And then, guys, we will make some new stuff. You will make a little one minute advertising break. Hi, guys. My name is Steve, and we've got a little commercial break. Ta da! We've got some commercial music coming. It's the first time, so. So, welcome to our commercial break. And we got a very special guest today. It's Mr. Bob. Hello, guys. Bob, what did you bring us? 
I bring you an absolutely fantastic, amazing new die-cast black display. Oh my God! I can't believe it! For what is it good for? It's for your cars in the scale of 164 and is had two parts. This is, this is so amazing! So I will show you guys. I will show you guys what's an absolutely fantastic thing I bring with me. So. Wow! This is, this is fantastic. It looks beautiful, guys. It looks beautiful. So what are you thinking about this? Is this awesome? Oh, this is so awesome! And it's black! It is black! Really? And I will show you what you can do. You can put some cars in it. No! Yes. No way! I never thought that I can use it for Hot Wheels! This is only for Hot Wheels. This is so amazing, Bob! This is absolutely amazing. I will uh, say you, you can put in 50 of these nice cars into our display. 50 cars! Wow! And I will say this is, this is absolutely... Oh, wow! I love it! Awesome! And we love you! And this is not too expensive! Wow. Thank you! Yeah, not too expensive! Is it? Yes, and I will show you another ah. nice feature of our display. This is our transparency cover. Wow! You can even use it when it's raining and you're outside! Like an umbrella! Yeah, and you, awesome. can, and you can build a house of this plastic. You can build a house! Yeah, and if you're a cold, you can make some fire with the plastic. <laughs> oh, that's awesome. <laughs> so, and I think you know all about. We are setting up, as you know, at the moment, some of our nice Hot Wheels Travel Jimmy online store. And in the next one week or two weeks, you can buy all this stuff from us. I love it. Or as we Germans say, ich liebe es. Yes. And we will set up all these uh, worldwide shipping costs and we are doing some nice uh, online shop at the moment. You can buy some, I hate this, um, you can buy a lot of nice limited edition cars uh, from us uh, as we've shown in our shows. And you can buy a lot of these nice displays. It's so amazing. I love it. So guys, we will see you with our nice displays the next week in our online store. And now our commercial break is finished. Thank you for watching. Yes, See you bye later. Bye guys. So guys, I'm back from uh, the restroom and uh, yeah. So what's going up, Stefan? Was all good? Everything was yeah? fine. Okay, nice. This was good. So guys, um, to show you some of these other cars in our big package and the desk is absolutely full of the cars so um i just received a question from diecast collector um and he says uh, hot wheels lost the license for ferrari do you know why no i don't know why um, because this is one of this is one of the news we heard uh, we heard about the license stuff because we heard about the license stuff that uh, Hot Wheels want to do more uh, a new license with Ferrari, yeah. But um, I think in personnel this is all about because Hot Wheels is working together with Lamborghini, mm -hmm. yeah. And if you are working together in the same automotive industry, so this is the same. A good example for an agency because you know we are working in an agency in original. Good example. I have a client, um, for example, I have a client, uh, for example, Mercedes, yeah. And Mercedes is our client in the agency. And there comes BMW and want to work with us together because they want to say, hey, you are the best agency in the world and we want to work with you together. So, but we have a contract with Mercedes. So, and this is the thing, the same thing on Hot Wheels. If you have a, a contract, yeah, there's some licensed stuff in it in the same industry that says, 
if you are working with us together and this is the same thing Hot Wheels is working together with Lamborghini and I think that um, the thing is Lamborghini has in his contracts to say guys if you're doing uh, um, uh, if you're giving us uh, um, you a license on Lamborghini you have to make sure that you're not working longer for Ferrari so I don't know really in fact what they did but this is the thing like in an agency if we are doing a contract with Mercedes for example in the contract details there was written um, you never have to work in the same industry for BMW for example so this can be a license conflict yeah thanks for your answer next yeah. question do you bring a Golf MK2 from Mike ah uh, no I've forgotten the stuff yeah he asked me right he asked me yeah I've forgotten the Golf 2 it's at home in the display you bring it next time. so sorry I have to bring I wrote me down that I have to bring the Golf yeah so this is on the box, Golf 2. Okay, right. next one. Sorry, sorry guys. Do you know Chris Singh? <sighs> Diecast Collector X is asking. I know Singh. Singh is a great Ameri uh, great Thai beer. No, I heard the name Chris Singh. I, I, I don't know. I'm not sure. I'm not sure. I'm not sure. Chris Singh. But I think, let's, let's have a look. Okay. Let's have a look. It's fine. Yeah? It's okay. fine. Good. We have 19 minutes, you know. No, only 90 minutes. So guys, okay, we are uh, uh, going a little bit faster um, uh, between this. So we have here uh, uh, also a Hong Kong car from the 80s. This is a Peugeot 405. It's also in a good condition. It's a gold color. And uh, but let's see. I will I will open this small package because I know really I know what's in because yes I bought all the cars and uh, let's open the small one. You have this scissor here. Yes. Yeah. We have the scissor. Okay, because I know, and some guys, of, uh, some of you guys want to see this, uh, um, this uh, real rider Bronco. As you know, I set up a post before that I uh, uh, was bought, uh, bought um, uh, one of these real rider Broncos. This is my first Bronco I, I, I got in the world of the real riders. I nearly have a lot of, uh, or I nearly have all real riders, but uh, the Bronco was missing in my collection. And uh, we will open uh, this box and see. And yeah, there are two cars in it. Yeah, we will open the first now. But here he is. Yeah, here he is. And this is this is the car we are waiting for. Yeah, this is um, 82 Real Rider Bronco in with all the plastic cabin with the chrome bike in the back, and it's in a perfect condition. I can't describe the uh, 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 condition at the moment, but it's perfect. And this was why we are buying the car, Stefan and me, because we need it in our uh, uh, collection. We had the car and uh, really nice stems from Goodyear, Bell, uh, 74, uh, 76, uh, Champion and so on. We love this car. And the other car, I also set a post up for you, um, is this Space Racer. As you know, this Space Racer car, it's, uh, it's a black wheel with... Uh, uh, super gun uh, on the top and uh, you saw the post I, uh, uh, we were setting up and it's from uh, it was from 70 78 and uh, also the the perfect uh, the condition is also perfect the look at the chrome there is nothing on the car there's nothing on the car it's without it's a loose car without the package but the car is absolutely perfect so we have these two cars now in our collection and um, Let's see a little bit. Oh, let's 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 talk. Um, uh, let's talk uh, five minutes um, because there are a lot of cars. I I will pick uh, uh, some cars for you. Um, but um, on Monday, as we said, let's um, let's do the first raffle thing. Yeah, we will find some of these absolutely uh, limited editions we have and set up a new raffle. We will see. I I think ten spots for you, like like the most of the guys doing, and then we will find a a nice prize. Um, unlimited spots, as you know, we will do it on Monday and then starting. And if uh, the session is full, yeah, we will um, 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 draw on the winner on this. As you know, on the other side, we will test it because, as I said, on one side, we want to give you some limited editions. But Stefan and me, we need a little bit of money for our all these things we are doing here. And we don't want to grab some of our private money. Yeah, and this is a refinancing system. So, um. Guys, there are some other cars. There's a there's a Corvette inside. I will go a little bit faster because 50 minutes. There's a nice Corvette. I shown you the last time on on the Corvette session. Then we have a lot of. Oh, this is 
too too much. These motorhome GMC, the, you are, I will show you. Um, you know the cars. These Palm Beach, yeah. We have one. We have two. We have three. Then we have four. We have five. We have six. We have. Oh, this is a lot. We have seven of these cars in in our box. This, but only three are in a good condition. This is this car, and this is the orange one here. And uh, there's another orange one. Uh, it's it's also uh, uh, good. And uh, yeah. So then we have here our good humor truck from '83. You know the car is also in in a, in, a, in an absolutely perfect condition. So. You know these uh, blue cards before the blue cards, and uh, so then we have here a lot of uh, uh, rapid transits. Yeah, these uh, school buses, as you know, two in 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 white color, one in a yellow color. Then what we have here, another oh, another nice crash car. Yeah, it's a it's a yellow variation. So this is really cool. This is amazing fun. And then we have here also another crash car. So this is also a nice piece. Yeah, this is also a, a front crash car. It's uh, coming from Hong Kong, 84. Nice. Oh man, Stefan, come here. We need uh, we need some firemen because wow. we have here three of these yellow rescue fire trucks. Yeah, <coughs> these typical airport fire trucks, and all the parts are on. All three pieces are fantastic in the condition. So nice found, absolutely nice. Then we have here. Oh guys, this is absolutely fantastic. So it's. This I remember those. I had them when I was small. Yes? Yes, really. So guys, the Greyhound buses, the full metal Greyhound buses, really, really cool. Uh, 79, made in Malaysia, not in Hong Kong, but the Greyhound bus is uh, fantastic. It's and it's so heavy. This is a so heavy car. It's with a so big uh, ground plate and uh, the condition is, uh, it's good. The Greyhound is on it. The logo is cool. It's a merry, a merry cruiser. And uh, yeah, perfect. So this car is in a better condition. This is not the best condition, but two of these heavy buses, perfect match for us. Perfect, absolutely nice. Ah, and one of my favorite buses. I have one, uh, two of these, you know, the Shell Pepsi uh, double bus. Yeah, with the uh, old Shell logo, with the old Pepsi logo on it, the double bus. This is also amazing car. Amazing car because of the logo. Yeah, the value comes from the logo, from the old Pepsi logo. So then we have here um, 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 the Barger Breaker. Yeah, the Barger Breaker. Two of these green Barger Breakers. Yeah, perfect condition, nearly good condition. Yeah, but uh, nice cars. You can open the hood. You know it. It's plastic. Um, you can open this stuff. So really nice. Found again double cars. Now we have 12 minutes, right? And you have a question, right? Yeah, we've got some questions concerning the new upcoming online shop. Okay. Um, so Guys, I can show you. I can, I can, I can show you something. Just maybe can give some, some will, basic info. Yeah, I will take uh, you with me. And this is our new logo. I hope you can see it. Hot Wheels Heaven Online Store. Yeah? This is our new logo. Hot Wheels Heaven Online Store. Why we are using... And uh, let's do it a little bit more private here. We can stop with the cars because you saw there are a lot of cars. Um, why we are using the name Hot Wheels Heaven? So uh, the shop is now in the background. You can't see the shop at the moment. We have the domain. We have set up the shop at the moment. But you can't see the shop. Why? Because we are hard working on the shop by night. We have a lot of to do in the agency, as you know, Stefan and me. And the only time we have is by night. So we are starting at... Weekend. Yeah, and, and weekend, weekend. yeah, but weekend is a family quality yes. time with the kids, yeah. not for you, you are a single, so if we find some nice girl, uh, girl for <laughs> Stefan, he is absolutely, um, it's an amazing guy, yeah, he is, it's uh, an amazing misunderstanding. Guy. Yeah. yeah, yeah, so, uh, um, but I, as you know, I have two little kids, I have not the, the time, yeah, if the family is sleeping on the weekend, um, we have the time um, to do some stuff, otherwise uh, we are doing the stuff um, by night. So we are beginning at uh, 10, for example, and then working up to 2 or 3 in the night to, to do this stuff. So why we are doing this? This is also, um, as you know, 10 years collecting on the global markets, you find a lot of cars, but you all, uh, also meet a lot of nice guys like you in our stream. We found a lot of collectors asking us, 
where you got the car from, can we buy the car? And I said, no, do you know me as a collector? I said, no, I want to uh, uh, keep the car in my collection. But now we are um, doing the decision to say, um, on one side, we want a little bit of reducing the collection because of the double or the triple cars we have. And we want to give you some some things back, some limited editions. You, you, you saw a lot of posts and uh, for me it's really hard, yeah, because uh, um, 10 years collecting on the markets and then you're grabbing, grabbing, grabbing the cars and you never want to, to, to let one car go, yeah. And, uh, but um, as you know, family guy, two little kids, um, not so much time, um, a huge collection, so we decided to, to, to sell some cars for you. And at the moment, uh, next Monday, we have a photo shooting here. Yeah, we have a, a photo shooting here. I don't want to say it before, but I can now, I can uh, engage you. We have a photo, photo, we will have a photo shooting here, uh, shoot the cars um, and other nice things for the store. Um, we have, uh, we had shooting all the displays at the moment. The displays are setting up in the store. So different packages from one to up to 10, uh, in a package to 50 or what else, how much you want to um, you want to buy, and um, um, it's not based on on commercial side because we are working in an agency. We have a fixed job. This is more um, from the lab to collectors to bring you together to um, get you the chance to find in our store um, limited editions complete. and uh, yeah and, and uh, complete collections. As you know, the revealers I uh, I buy I uh, bought 12 cars. For example, the revealers will also in, in our online store and there's a collection limited edition and also new cars. So if you're in, uh, collecting a new car and why we are doing this, uh, I think in a, a long time I was thinking about um, to have a real Hot Wheels store in the city. Yeah? This is my dream, yeah? well this was my dream to have a real Hot Wheels store in the city like some guys in the US. Uh, in German um, I don't find some, some of these specialized Hot Wheels uh, uh, things. But we will show you in the next um, days a little bit more about the, um, the cars we are putting in. We will have on Monday the first ruffle. And then I think end of next week, we will finish with the first cars in the online store. It's worldwide shipping, different shipping costs, as you know, because selling from Germany and the US is the same as I have to pay a lot of shipping costs grabbing some stuff from the US market. Yeah. You have a question, Stefan? Yeah, we're going to... Um We've got a question about the raffles. Oh, I'm live. Yeah, you're live. Hi, guys. Um, you ask about what are the raffles and how do they work. I would say, because we just have seven minutes, we will think about a concept, what we can do. Because today we ask, you ask, uh, do you like to have raffles? Yeah. And then we think about what we can do. And then before the next show happens, we will uh, think about a concept, what to do, or maybe explain even during um, a post or in the next show um, what, how, what and how a raffle it can be. It's yeah. a little bit confusing because I see myself in the yeah, screen. Yeah, you see yourself. <laughs> I'm, I'm moving. The Thank screen. you very much. And for, for one minute, I will have a little explanation on the raffles. It's coming from the US market in, in the first, and what, how it, is it working? So, for example, you have, we, we give you five cars. And the five cars, in our opinion, has a value of 50 US dollars, for example. So, and what we will do then, we give you 10, uh, 10 spots. These are places. Um, you can pay, for example, uh, five US dollars in one of the places. Uh, pay this five via PayPal. So we are seeing that you are in the game for uh, buying your a place. For five US dollars, you are buying a place in the game. 10 spots and so on, and but as Stefan said, uh, we will explain on Monday, because before we doing the raffle, we will have in our show um, the explanation about how to do a raffle and what's the best way to do a raffle. Because I saw, I saw some of the German guys want to do some, some raffles and nobody got in because it's coming from the US and all the guys know it. Yeah? But in German it's a, it's a, um, a little bit more complicated, not, we are doing we are not doing some raffles in Germany. Yeah, it's coming from the US market, Asia market, what else, but not coming from us in Germany. But we will explain on Monday, and um, we will see um, if we can, or we will do some, a video, for example, on Monday to push the video uh, um, in one minute explanation how to do a raffle. Yeah. I think this is a good way. And on the evening, we will set up the first raffle. It is a raffle, a pool with the spots. 
yeah, you are in the game and then we draw the winner on Monday, yeah, Monday evening or Thursday, how long it or yeah. next live show. Or next live show, what else? No, or the day later. If the if the uh, package is full with all the spots, then we will do it um, a little bit later. So we only have um, at the moment, let's see. Five minutes. Ah, oh, we have five minutes. So I will go in the original position with you guys because then you don't see my face so near. Yeah, okay. <laughs> yeah. So, um, we can do the, the last cars. Five minutes. Yeah, the last cars. There's a hot one. Uh, the Ultra Hot Corvette, as I shown. There is a white uh, Sheriff Patrol. There is a U.S. mail uh, truck. This is a nice car. There is another um, uh, Ultra Hot. This is uh, I've forgotten the name. It's from this Beast mode thing. Then we have yeah. These two things, you know, the truck, the by byway man, uh, the eagle version, two eagle versions, a blue, one in a good condition, one in a uh, not really good condition, but two cars. Then we have two more tank trucks here, yeah, so also in in okay uh, uh, condition. What we have then, yeah, you know it, in the orange one, we show you last time. Then we have some more old timers. We have an 82, yeah, also in a nice condition. Really nice. Ah, I can't uh, remember all the names. This is Auburn. Auburn 852, uh, 78. Also in a nice condition. No lamp, lamp brakes and what else. Then what we have. There's not so much cars in it. Ah, this is also a nice one. As you know, this is the Omni. Uh, the Omni 924. I showed you some of the uh, cars before. It's not the perfect condition, but it's a rare car. It's a rare car, yeah? So, if you can grab some of these cars, do it. Then we have a color shifter, um, Volkswagen Baja. Yeah, this is a color shifter, also going in the color yellow. We need to speed up because yes. I want to know which is the most valuable car of all the cars, if you finish that. Yeah, I and will which finish is the this. one you like the this most? This is a newer one. This is, uh, I don't know, a Johnny Lightning or what else. This is not a Hot Wheels. And... Uh, this is another truck, and this is another van. This is also very nice. Another US mail, then another ultra hot, and then our box is empty. empty. So the last one here, um, most expensive, and which you like the most from the hundred cars. Most valuable car, the Ford. Yeah. Most valuable car because uh, um, um, of the age and uh, the the stamp because U.S. patented and uh, uh, Hong Kong and 75. So for me, the most valuable car. How much is it? Uh, in the loose About. condition. In the loose condition at the moment, um, it's different. In the U.S. market, you have to pay I think 20 U.S. dollars for 25 U.S. dollars, for example. In Germany, you have to pay a lot of more for this car. I paid the last one uh, 35 euros. For this car, and this is, uh, as you know, US market against the German market, other prices. Your market is full of these cars. The German market needs this car. Can we sell it on the shop? Yeah, we I can, take it. We can, okay. we can sell it on the shop. And these are my favorites. I love these Fords in a, in a good condition. As you know, the real riders, these are my favorites. And uh, this real rider, and this real rider, and the Byway Man Real Rider, and these are my favorite cars. And guys, we only have one minute. One minute. So, and as you know, I love all Camaros. Yeah, this is this comes in the collection. We will see. <laughs> guys, we will see. We will see um, which cars we are setting up as loose cars in our shop end of next week. Uh, we will see how many um, uh, package limited edition cars we will set up in our. Uh, it's a pain on my side, but um, yeah. Uh, but we will do and also with the displays and on Monday we will doing the first raffle and uh, we wish you a nice weekend. I have to drive 